Hello and welcome to a new video of my Unity MMO tutorial series and in this lecture we will continue with Uma. Okay, at first we have to create a UI canvas and in this canvas we create a panel and you can switch from 3D to 2D. It's a little bit better for managing the UI. And yeah, um, add a component here. Um, it's a vertical, vertical uh, layout group. Um, and we add we um need to create everything with with ten and now um let's yeah let's change the stuff here we anchor it on the right side and the w width of this u i will be three three hundred and twenty seven and four hundred and sixty five hey hi and we change the color maybe to black and we will create it like this and let's check the play button as you can see it's a little bit small but we i will zoom uh to the character and yeah later on so it will be look a little bit nicer and i will will um Rename this to customization panel and left because we um, add another one for the right side um, later. But now, yeah, it's okay for this. Yeah, that we don't want sorry i tested something um maybe we uh, create it um in the future a little bit better but at first it it's uh, okay in this case we can move it a little bit more to the left size I don't know why the size is 700. I guess we need to change it in another way. I don't know yet. And um yeah. Back to the panel. Um the heading text and right click on it and create UI text mesh pro. That's what I said in the last lecture and then you need to click import here so we don't get any error and if everything is correct imported there's no error and we can as you can see there's a new text if you have any problems you have to delete this one and create a new 
Text Smash Pro and you don't have any any problems. I will um say character customizer and from time to time we will change a lot of things and we will uh, modify it and yeah. Okay. And after this I will rename it to headline so you can see that is a uh, top of the UI and yeah after this we um, create um yeah we will create an empty game object uh, I will start uh, like this. It's a little bit better uh, because then we don't need to change um, things and we create a new game object in our story in our We need to create it here I will delete this one and create a new one in the panel uh, create empty and Ah, okay, sorry. I have to create it in the the customization panel. Sorry. <laughs> okay, and um, I will um, rename it I um, because we want to change the height with it. And after this, I create a new text mesh pro text, and I will change the size font size to twenty, and we uh, say the name is height of it, and then we can place it on the right way. Sorry, I took the wrong. Change this. So we have the height here in the uh, right click on height and add the slider. And slider got the right stuff. I will create I of twenty. It's a bit yeah, and. And I will change the size of fifty, and then I have to resize the slider and the text mesh and slider. And if you hit the play button, you can. You can see our slider. And yeah, uh, now we only need to duplicate this one. And yeah, we will rename the second one. Wait. So we can change the weight of of the character, and the last one will be muscle, and this will be mass 
well and now we can yeah we will add to another thing but uh, we need to drop it a little bit more down or oh, no it's it's okay um in this case we can change later and i will call it hair so we can change the hair with uh, with the slider and we also want to change the skin color and i skin color and i need to change the size of object okay and if you hit the play button you can see that everything is correct here we can change this later and yeah of course i don't want to um i don't want to do a lot of stuff in will more concentrate on the programming stuff and yeah so that's all for the for the first ui Uma. and if you have any question or any problems you can join my discord server or you can leave a comment down below the video and if you think my content is good you can leave me a like thank you for watching see ya